As a new day begins, even before you wake, a field of mirrors rises to greet the sun, capturing its rays and harnessing its energy. As it starts to heat up in the morning when the sun comes out, we start to pump the fluid through the pipes and start gaining all that energy from the sun. With the parabolic mirrors, it basically concentrates it like a magnifying glass. More than 190,000 mirrors focus the sunlight onto a thin tube filled with liquid, heating it to 740 degrees. That superheated liquid gets piped to the neighboring Martin power plant, where it generates steam and powers a turbine to create electricity, enough to provide for 11,000 homes. Well, it's good for customers because burning less fossil fuel means a lower carbon footprint, less air emissions. This project represents the world's first hybrid solar power plant. When the sun is shining, this innovative design gives FPL the ability to supplement its natural gas plant using solar energy. The hybrid power plant, like a hybrid car, aims to maximize power while reducing the need for fossil fuels. When the sun's out, we kind of take our foot off the gas pedal a little bit. We burn less fossil fuel. Like in a hybrid car, you burn less gasoline in the car, and more from electricity. So it's similar in that manner. And just as a hybrid car saves you money on gas, the hybrid power plant saves on fuel costs using free energy from the sun. I mean, this is a marquee project for sure that's being looked at throughout the world.